Just coming around the trains. I'm getting back to the bridge. We can't really see the power plant, but I just got in as much as the area as I can. I did not get in the plant. We're not allowed. Now, I'm going to cross over this bridge again. Again, this side on the plant side is not nearly as safe as the other side. The boards are... Look at the boards there. Once I get past the middle, the boards are more secure, but out here, you can see all the rottedness. Like, I don't want to step on that middle board. I was just at that power plant, walking around the weeds to the outside and checking some empty buildings. Uh, outside the plant and I got a bunch of ticks on me so if you're afraid of ticks or don't want them on you I wouldn't recommend going there I'm wearing a bright green shirt so I can see them and so hunters and others can see me okay oh shit I stepped on a board that almost went through right there these boards yeah right here this well, I don't know if you can see it, but you can see that baby bowing in. If I fall right now, at least I'm going into the water if I don't hit any steel going down. But Again, look how rotted that third piece is, look at that one there, all these, look how they're all caved in, rotted out. Ooh. Yeah, I stepped on that piece and I felt that thing bow, that ain't good. Okay. Again, some views of the Allegheny River, which most people who see my videos and pictures and know me, I am absolutely fascinated with the Allegheny River. Look at the views of the foothills of the mountains. Look at the clouds. In fact, I'm going to stop and get a picture and pick up the video in a second. I just came to the other side. Again, it's not the safe. I jumped the steel beams because this wood is completely rotted. But look at the views. Allegheny River. I don't know where I'm at. I'm close to Templeton. I don't know if I'm in Templeton. I'm going to go a little further since I'm on this side. The boards are a little more stable here. I feel a little more secure. But again, if I fall, I'm going to go swimming in the river for a little bit. If I don't hit, hit any of that steel structure going down. Just amazingly breathtaking. Say we're about a third of the way. Once we get to the halfway point, the boards are more secure and a little more stable. Yeah, the wood's not looking so rotten up here. I mean, that obviously is, but the big, thick cross members. Well, now that I say that, I'm looking at that shit. But.
Yeah, look at that. That's all caved in, rotted. So a scale of one to five for safety. Five being the safest, one being not safe at all. I'd give it a 1.5. This is not safe. I do not recommend this for anybody. That's the bridge. I got here earlier and took the first part of the first video. My car is under the bridge over there. Holy shit, look at that. I'm glad I looked. Look at that. Yeah, that ain't good. Ooh. Yeah, that one, that board's not too stable. Some I have anytime you go on an adventure like this please by all means tell your spouse the person you live with family member where exactly you're going in case you don't come home or in case you call for help and can't give a location or they need to the, the 911 needs to find you through your the GPS in your phone always tell someone where you're going boards are collapsed there there's a steel header under here, but look, if I'm walking in the middle, I can fall through. It's the river, and there's no steel. Well, there's a steel head right there. I'm on a steel beam, so yep. I definitely get messed up on the way down. I made it to the middle of the bridge. There's four. If you look, the part that goes up. It goes down, there's four connecting pieces. So there's one, this is the end of the second one, beginning of the third one, it goes down, and there's another one down there. So right now, I'm in the middle of the bridge on the Allegheny River. By that electric uh, power plant I couldn't get in. Enjoying these beautiful views. And again, I'm gonna connect these videos together, but if anyone watches just this video, this is not a safe bridge to walk on. It's all rotted. It's coll woods collapse, rotted. But this was well worth the trip just for the views. The Allegheny River. We're gonna work our way back. Ooh, I don't know if you can see that fluxing, but it's weak. You can see that one's about to cave in. the Allegheny River. That way. Turn around. Walk up north. Can't see much going around that bend. Remarkable, just beautiful out here. We continue our journey. I'm past the halfway point going back to my car. This is where the wood is safer. I still don't recommend it, but it's a lot more stable here than on the other side of this, the other half of the bridge. It's not nearly as stable with, with more rotted wood. Just about over the Allegheny. Now this is this is where I crossed before. It's a little sketchy. You can see that board. That one's busted. There's a couple boards collapsed. That's no way near safe. So right where the steel beam crosses, where the iron connects, I'm crossing over here. And 
it's still not the safest, but it's a hell of a lot more secure than that side. That board's a little shaky, we want to avoid that. Okay, that's the bridge. The first part of the video, if I connect these videos, that's where I went to get a picture of this bridge and that power plant, which again, I could not get in legally. Uh, people feel more safe when they're on the land part, but I don't know why, because if I fall and hit ground, I'll definitely be killed or, or severely hurt. In the water, you know, at least I can you know, swim to shore if it's deep enough and I don't bottom out and hit a rock. Okay. We're coming to the point. There's my car directly under us. Yeah, see, I don't want to fall and end up on top of that car or some other way. Again, if you do come out here, wear something bright and don't wear shorts or, or no socks because I've had several ticks I had to pick off me. Okay, we're at the end. Again, the gates are open, so I do not feel there's no trespassing, there's no signs. Okay, we're back. Now about 400 yards from what I'm told, there's a train tunnel I'm gonna go visit. And just for record, like we just dominated this bridge the whole way across there. And back. Okay, time to go this way and find a train tunnel.